Hi dear students, welcome back to our channel and when I come out basics of physics. This is the right place to learn. So dear students, in this video we are going to discuss one of the most important topic and that should be short answer question number 3. This is not only important and very easiest question. Clear? So that question is very very easy one. Easy to learn, easy to listen and easy to understand. Okay? So without late we are going to the question topic. Here now this is the short answer question number 3 in the chapter of motion in a straight line and that is belongs to junior inter. Question is can the velocity of an object be in a direction other than the direction of acceleration of the object if so give example. Can the velocity of an object be in a direction other than the direction of acceleration of the object if so give example. What he was asking? Velocity, acceleration, rendu and heavy, different directions lo unta ya, unte example ivani under nadu. Clear? Can the velocity of the body is other than the direction of acceleration? That is the concept. So, I te manaki example ichi na puru manaki vake vake world raste manaki one mark kosadi. Vade man nadu both are in other direction, both are in different directions unta ya nadu. So, that is simple ga manamu. S undai S and you word raste manaki one mark or study clear as children in daily life acceleration and velocity must be in different directions in some cases clear the first thing is here when the body is vertically projected when the body is vertically projected when it is moving in upward direction the direction of velocity is in upward direction but acceleration is in downward direction clear so in case of a vertically projected body it is the vertically projected body it is having initial velocity u and final velocity v while it is moving in upward direction maybe velocity is decreases velocity is decreases but there is some resultant value of velocity then it is moving in upward direction so in this case velocity is in upward direction clear and next thing is what it is here velocity and in final velocity and initial velocity what right here a is equals to v minus u by t a is equals to v minus u by t we will take so here what we get for example here uh, this is 30 and this is some 60 meter per second it is provided with the velocity of 60 after moving some distance velocity is decreases it means that what is s minus 30 by t something value it is acceleration is negative that's why what right a is equals to what right minus g so children so you have to simply remember that why the velocity is decreases because it is moving in opposite direction of s gravitational force gravitational force is always in downward direction and this is what it is gravitational force that is what I have to say mg that should be in downward direction due to applied force it is moving in upward direction initial velocity is more and gradually velocity is going to be decreased why because the gravitational force can affect the applied force clear that's why the net force is more when the gravitational force is more than the applied force that should be comes down after moving some distance when the applied force is more than the gravitational force it will goes up so when there is some resultant force in upward direction the velocity is also in upward direction so gravitational force punches in up kuda net force value on the value on up to body that should be goes in upward direction but the change in velocity what is occurred because of gravitational force that should be in downward direction what i am telling now it is 60 meter per second and this is 30 meter per second i am saying now why the velocity changes because of gravitational force that's why here the acceleration what it is there that is because of gravitational force that should be in downward direction that should be in downward direction that's why children the first example is simply how to write when the body is going up when the body is going up Velocity direction is in upward and acceleration is downward. It is a very clear thing. And second example it is there. Look here. 
example one already is look here runs can the velocity of an object be in a direction other than the direction of acceleration of the object answer is s velocity of the body be in a direction other than the direction of acceleration of the object velocity direction and the acceleration direction different ga untundi antam example one when a vertically parallel body is moving upwards velocity of motion is in upwards and acceleration is in the downward direction clear and now example 2 when brakes are applied the velocity of the body before coming to rest is opposite to the retarding acceleration and for example this is the wheel of the vehicle wheel of the vehicle when brakes are applied when brakes are applied but due to the inertia of motion the wheel is going in forward direction after moving some distance only it is coming to the rest clear ఒక వెహికల్ మూవ్ అవుతున్నప్పుడు బ్రేక్స్ వేసినప్పుడు ఏమవుతుంది అంటే ఇమీడియట్ గా ఆగదు కొంత డిస్టెన్స్ వెళ్ళి అవుతుంది బట్ ఈస్ దట్ ఈస్ బికాస్ ఆఫ్ ఇనర్షియా ఆఫ్ మోషన్ సో ఈ ఆ డైరెక్షన్ లో ఏమవుతుందంటే అప్పుడు ఏమవుతుంది అంటే ద వెలాస్ట్ షుడ్ బి ఇన్ ఫార్వర్డ్ డైరెక్షన్ బట్ ద యాక్సలేషన్ వాట్ ఇట్ ఈస్ దే ద షుడ్ బి రిటార్డేషన్ నెగిటివ్ యాక్సలేషన్ వై బికాస్ వెన్ ద బ్రేక్స్ ఈస్ అప్లై ఆటోమేటికలీ వెలాస్ట్ ఈస్ గోయింగ్ టు బి రెడ్యూసెస్ మనకి స్పీడ్ గా అవుతున్న వ్యక్తికి ఒకేసారి ఒకేసారి మనం బ్రేక్ వేసినప్పుడు ఏమవుతుందంటే వాటి యొక్క స్పీడ్ అనేది వెలాసి అనేది మాక్సిమం వాల్యూ నుంచి లెస్ వాల్యూకి వస్తుంది అప్పుడు చేంజ్ ఇన్ వెలాసి ఏమవుతుంది నెగిటివ్ అవుతుంది మనం ఫర్ ఎగ్జాంపుల్ వాట్ వి నో ఏఈస్ ఈక్వల్స్ టు చేంజ్ ఇన్ వెలాసిటీ బై టైమ్ చేంజ్ ఇన్ వెలాసిటీ బై టైమ్ దిస్ ఈస్ ద యాక్సలరేషన్ so for example i am saying now 80 meter per second is the speed of the vehicle when the brakes is suddenly applied it is coming to be like 20 meter per second like that then in this case it what is he say it is the negative acceleration negative acceleration what we call retardation so that's why here change velocity em avutundi 20 minus 80 avutundi that is minus 60 avutundi okay na so ee values anni pakkana padithe em avutundi ante simple ga ఎప్పుడైతే మనం బ్రేక్స్ అప్లై చేసామో అప్లై చేసినప్పుడు ఆ వీల్ అనేది కొంచెం ముందుకు వెళ్ళి ఆగుతుంది అంటే వెలాసి డైరెక్షన్ ఫార్వర్డ్ లో ఉంటుంది ఆ నెగిటివ్ యాక్సలేషన్ ఏవైతే ఉంటుందో దట్ షుడ్ బీన్ బ్యాక్వర్డ్ డైరెక్షన్ దట్స్ వాట్ హ్యావ్ టు సే వెన్ బ్రేక్స్ ఆర్ అప్లైడ్ ద వెలాసిటీ ఆఫ్ బాడీ బిఫోర్ కమింగ్ టు రెస్ట్ ఈజ్ అపోజిట్ టు ది రిటార్డింగ్ యాక్సలరేషన్ సో బ్రేక్స్ అప్లై చేసినప్పుడు వెలాసి డైరెక్షన్ ఏమో ఫార్వర్డ్ ఉంటుంది రిటార్డ్ యాక్సలేషన్ ఏమో బ్యాక్వర్డ్ ఉంటుంది clear that's why what you have to say is velocity and acceleration both are in different directions okay children so very easy question so while you are watching notes make the notes and you have to follow the very clearly answer okay na if you can understand this one like share comment the video children so meek intermediate videos anni kuda kavali ante you have to follow the regularly my channel and subscribe my channel too thank you